Economic slowdown in the nation hit both real incomes and spending. We're seeing numbers not seen since the global financial crisis in late 2000s. Kim yo Sun has this report. The sluggish local economy last year, coupled with uncertainties at home and abroad, led to a drop in both household income and spending. Statistics Korea said Friday that in 2016, the average household brought in a total monthly income of a little under 4.4 million Korean won, or about 3,800 U.S. dollars, a rise of just 0.6 percent from the previous year. That's down from the 1.6 percent on-year growth posted in 2015, and is also the slowest gain since 2003, when the government began collecting such data. The reason overall income rose by so little is that money from work or earned income rose by a mere 1 percent, the smallest increase on record. The average Korean household saw earned income of around $2,600. In terms of what their income will buy, so-called real income adjusted for inflation, that amount fell by four-tenths of a percent, the first decline since 2009 in the aftermath of the financial crisis. Stagnating income naturally led to more people to tighten their belts. The amount they had left over after paying the bills or their disposable income rose by only seven-tenths of a percent, also the slowest gain since 2009. The government says it aims to raise incomes while providing more support for vulnerable classes to stabilize the livelihoods of the public. Kim Yo-sun, Arirang News.